Welcome back. This segment is sponsored by West Michigan Home and Garden Show, which is starting this afternoon. The show is back for its 41st season, and we are at getting a sneak peek of what's to come with Natalie Carmelo, and we have who is with Spring Meadow Nursery in Grand Haven, and she's here to talk about specific plants that we will do or that will do well in 2020. But you have an amazing spread that is just all over. <laughs> yeah, 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 they're nice No, and but it's just a good, you know, mm -hmm. we got a lot. We were just talking about how these are a breed of roses, mm -hmm. you know, in the family. But what I really want to know is, you know, what can people expect for this season? What are some good plants to put out in your garden, I guess? Well, I guess what it really starts with is you can never go wrong if uh, you choose a plant that's been tested. Okay. Uh, there's a lot of brands out there that have gone ahead and they've tested out, they've tested their plants really rigorously mm -hmm. to make sure that the plant that you're putting in your garden is going to be super disease free, it's going to grow in a vigorous yeah. way, and it's going to have lots and lots of flowers, the things that make you feel really, really successful in the garden. Of so course. I guess the best thing to know is go with something like a proven winner's plant or talk to your garden center and ask them, you know, what's going to perform really well in my garden because everybody's garden yes. is different. Mm -hmm. And so for beginners and you know basic tips for us aka me, mm -hmm. you know what can they do to spruce up their garden or if it's their first time putting something out I guess. Well the first thing you need to think about are what are the needs of your garden. Mm -hmm. So everybody's garden's different like we talked before. Some people have more shade, some people have a lot of sun, some people don't have room for a garden at all and they yeah. want to grow things in a container and that's okay too. You can mix a lot of things in containers. You can mix perennials and annuals and even little shrubs like uh, these guys right here. Mm -hmm. um, so talk to your garden center, mm -hmm. tell them what you've got, what you've got going, yeah. and um, they're going to really, really help you choose what's best for your garden and what's going to make you happiest because that's what gardening's all of about. Of course. And so I want to talk about a little bit what you brought here. So I, I know I said these are a type of roses, but mm -hmm. to be more specific, what are these? <laughs> so this is called Oh So Easy Double Red Rose. Okay. And believe it or not, this is a shrub rose. Wow. So this is one of our Oh So Easy series. We have uh, 12 roses in the series. They come in a whole bunch of different colors, but this is the 2020 Proven Winners Rose of the Year. Mm -hmm. And you can see why it's got this beautiful double yes. flower. If you look closely, you can see there are buds all over it. Mm -hmm. So this blooms from spring all the way till frost. I had a friend that planted this next to her business. I went and checked in on yeah. it last October covered with oh roses. Oh my gosh. So they're so really good easy to grow, lots of success yeah. for the home and gardener. And you are going to be at the Home and Garden Show, and are I you going am. to be kind of giving some examples? You know, what are you going to be talking about? I sure am. So if you wanted to see all of the variety of proven winners at the Garden Show, you can go to uh, booth 103. Okay. You're going to see annuals there, perennials there, and shrubs. And yes. I'll be on the Proven Winner stage at 2 o'clock tomorrow, that's Friday, yeah. talking about colorful, compact shrubs for the home gardener. Yeah, and I know we talked, so you don't specifically have a store, but what are, you know, where can people go to pick up their, their plants and their flowers for the season? Well, we always first recommend going to your local garden yes. center because they are the people who are really experienced that can really help you choose the plants that are right for your garden. Mm -hmm. If you see something here, like you're like, oh, I really want this little inkberry holly, yeah. you can go to provenwinners.com com and you can buy it as well mm -hmm. but uh, I would say stop at your garden center first and um, if you if you see something here like you see oh so yeah. easy double red rose ask them if they can bring it in if they don't have it there because they usually can accommodate you Yeah, perfect thank you so much Natalie these are beautiful and I'm so excited for you to go out and share all these details because you know I need them and we all need them so again the West Michigan home and garden show runs this Thursday or today and through Sunday at the DeVos place and if you want all the tickets and show times you can visit our website 13 on your side .com, and we'll be right back